ఎస్ఈ సంయుక్త పీజీటీ మ్యాథమెటిక్స్ టీఎస్ఎంఎస్ బెజ్జంకి సిద్దిపేట్ డిస్టిక్ చిల్డ్రన్ అబ్జర్వ్ ద ఇమేజెస్ కేర్ఫుల్లీ ఫస్ట్ వన్ ఈజ్ బంచ్ ఆఫ్ ఫ్లవర్స్ సెకండ్ వన్ ఈజ్ బంచ్ ఆఫ్ కీస్ థర్డ్ వన్ ఈజ్ గ్రూప్ ఆఫ్ లెటర్స్ ఫోర్త్ వన్ ఈజ్ స్కూల్ బ్యాగ్స్ ఆఫ్ చిల్డ్రన్ అబ్జర్వ్ ద గివెన్ ఇమేజెస్ కేర్ఫుల్లీ ఇయర్ వాట్ డూ యూ అబ్జర్వ్ ఎవ్రీథింగ్ ఈజ్ ఇన్ ద ఫామ్ ఆఫ్ ఏ గ్రూప్ ఎవ్రీథింగ్ ఈజ్ ఇన్ ద ఫామ్ ఆఫ్ ఏ గ్రూప్ ఇన్ మ్యాథమెటికల్లీ ఇట్ కెన్ బి రీడ్ యాజ్ ఏ సెట్ టుడే అవర్ టాపిక్ ఇంట్రడక్షన్ టు సెట్స్ డెఫినేషన్ ఆఫ్ ఏ సెట్ ద కలెక్షన్ ఆఫ్ వెల్ డిఫైన్డ్ డిస్టిక్ట్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ ఈజ్ నోన్ యాజ్ ఏ సెట్ ద వర్డ్ వెల్ డిఫైన్డ్ రిఫర్స్ టు ఏ స్పెసిఫిక్ ప్రాపర్టీ విచ్ మేక్స్ ఇట్ ఈజీ టు ఐడెంటిఫై వెదర్ ద గివెన్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ బిలాంగ్స్ టు ద సెట్ ఆర్ నాట్ ద వర్డ్ డిస్టిక్ట్ మీన్స్ దట్ ద ఆబ్జెక్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ ఏ సెట్ మస్ట్ బి ఆల్ డిఫరెంట్ వాట్ ఈస్ ద డెఫినేషన్ ఆఫ్ ఏ సెట్ ద కలెక్షన్ ఆఫ్ వెల్ డిఫైన్డ్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్స్ ఆర్ things is called a set what is well defined in a set the objects must and should the objects must and should have a specific property what is distinct the objects of a set must be all different examples how to state that whether the objects form a set or not a set of numbers from 1 to 10 here observe this carefully a set of numbers from 1 to 10 we know 1 to 10 numbers 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 comma 5 comma 6 comma 7 comma 8 comma 9 comma 10 this is well defined means this is a set the second one a set of all letters that comes after u we know after u letters v comma w comma x comma y comma z this is also countable countable means this is a set the third one a set of good students fourth one is a set of generous people in 3 and 4 examples good comma generous words are not clearly or not measured see in example 3 a set of good students some students good for you and some students good for me so this is not clear means this is not a set here in these four examples 1 and 2 are examples of a set and 3 and 4 are not a sets elements of set the different objects that form a set are called the elements of a set the elements of the set are written in any order and are not repeated elements are denoted by small letters the elements belongs to a set means this is elements of a set students here remember one thing sets are denoted by capital letters in a set elements are denoted by small letters and also repeated letters are elements right only one time in a set representation of a set in representation in representation of a set the following two methods are commonly used first one roster or tabular form method second one rule or set builder form method first one roster form or tabular form 
in this elements of the set are listed within the pair of brackets or flower brackets and are separated by commas examples of a roster form first one the set of all letters in the word mathematics therefore z equals to m comma a comma t comma h comma e comma i comma c comma s observe the children carefully here z equals to in a set z repeated letters written only one time why because this is a set here repeated letter letters written only one time and separated by commas in a set the elements separated by commas means that is roster form the set of all vowels of the english alphabet therefore v equals to we know english alphabets of vowels a comma e comma i comma o comma u next one is set builder form in this a rule or the formula or the statement is written within the pair of brackets so that the set is well defined in the set builder form all the elements of the set must possess a single property to become the member of that set in this of representation of a set the element of the set is described by using a symbol x or any other variable followed by a colon is used to denote such that and then we write the property possessed by the elements of the set and enclose the whole description in process in this the colon stands for such that and process stand for set of all what is the definition of set builder form in set builder form write the statements only in a set write the statements only in a set with condition write the statements with condition in a set is called set builder form examples of set builder form if x equals to 4 comma 5 comma 6 comma 7 this is expressed in roster form let us express it in set builder form x equals to x such that x is a natural number and 3 is less than x is less than 8 observe the given condition here 3 is less than x is less than 8 here given x is a natural number x is greater than 3 and less than 8 means here natural number starts with 4 and below 7 means 4 comma 5 comma 6 comma 7 x equals to 4 comma 5 comma 6 comma 7 is a roster form roster form of this set builder form is x such that x is a natural number and 3 is less than x is less than Eight. The set of a of all odd natural numbers can be written as a equals to x such that x is a natural number and x equals to two n plus one for small n belongs to W. Here W means whole numbers. Notation of sets. Students observe given notations carefully. this will be used in our topic sets belongs belongs to does not belongs to such that phi null set or empty set n of a cardinal number of the set a union union of two sets here reverse u means intersection of two sets capital n set of natural numbers w set of whole numbers capital i r z set of integers z plus set of all positive integers q set of all rational numbers q plus set of all 
positive rational numbers or set of all real numbers or place set of all positive real numbers c set of all complex numbers types of sets empty set or null set a set which does not contain any element is called an empty set or the null set or the void set and it is denoted by pi and is read as pi in roster form pi is denoted by flower brackets an empty set is a finite set since the number of elements in an empty set is finite that is zero observe the examples first one is the set of whole numbers less than zero observe the condition carefully here whole numbers less than zero we know whole number starts with zero but here given whole numbers less than zero whole numbers less than zero means here no re, no whole numbers no whole numbers means here no elements no elements means this is a empty set second one capital n equals to x such that x is belongs to n 3 is less than x is less than 4 here x is belongs to n means x is a rational number a 3 is less than x is less than 4 here x is greater than 3 less than 4 observe the given condition carefully in lies between 3 and 4 no rational numbers we know this no rational numbers lies between 3 and 4 means here no elements between 3 and 4 means here This is a empty set or null set or void set. Single null set, a set which contains only one element, is called a single null set. For example, a equals to x such that x is neither prime nor composite. It is a single null set containing one element that is one. Here given x such that x is neither prime nor composite. Neither prime nor composite means we know that is one. One here only one element. A set contains one element means that is single null set. See second one x such that x is a whole number x less than one. This set contains only one element zero and is a single null set. X such that x is a whole number. X is less than one. Whole numbers below one. Whole numbers starts with zero. Below one means one element that is zero. A set contains one element means this is a single null set. Finite set. A set which contains a definite number of elements is called a finite set. Empty set is also called a finite for example the set of all colors in the rainbow we know rainbow colors vibzr vibzr means that is seven colors means here seven colors is countable countable means this is a finite set second one capital n equals to x such that x is belongs to capital n x is less than 7 the below seven natural numbers we know 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 comma 5 comma 6 these are also countable means this is also a finite set third one p equals to 2 comma 3 comma 5 comma 7 comma 11 comma 13 comma 17 so on 97 here also ending number means given means this is also finite set infinite set the set whose elements cannot be listed that is set contain never ending elements is called an infinite set here four examples given the first one set of all points in a plane we know that plane contains number of 
elements we can't count the points means this is infinite infinite means given first example is infinite set second one capital a equals to x such that x is belongs to capital n comma x greater than 1 here natural numbers greater than 1 means start start with 2 but here ending number not given means this is also infinite means this is also a infinite set third one set of all prime numbers set of all prime numbers means here also condition not given means this is also a infinite set fourth one b equals to x such that x is belongs to w x equals to 2n here also ending condition not given means this is also a infinite set students listen one mathematics quotation this tells about greatness of mathematics without mathematics there is nothing you can do everything around you is mathematics everything around you is numbers i hope children this is useful for you thank you